Does the prospect of running for president fire you up? And do you kind of like the idea of going for it, if at all the sun, moon, and stars align? You I mean, I like challenges. In New Hampshire, Eric Holder gave what sounded a lot like a campaign speech. If we are about that, if we are about pulling that arc towards justice, we can make this country um, better. And it's not about making this country great again. This country is great, but it can be better. The trip comes as the former attorney general openly weighs a presidential run in 2020. What I've said about the presidency is that there's something that I'm considering. Um, it's not, and I said I'd make a decision on that, you know, sometime um, next year. Um, do you mind if I take a picture? Sure. Oh, okay. <laughs> His remarks focused on the issue of gerrymandering, a cause he's taken up since leaving office. The notion that we have in the United States that it's one person, one vote, and that that vote should count, that notion is, uh, is, under, is under attack. Also, President Trump's recent pardons. I think the, the president is trying to send a message to some people who uh, potentially um, might be involved in the, the Russia investigation. New Hampshire holds the first presidential primary in the nation, and voters here know what to ask. We love young Democrats. Yes, we, do. we love young Especially Democrats. Yeah. Can you beat Donald Trump? Two guys from Queens. That, that, <laughs> that'd be, that would be, uh, that'd be interesting. <laughs>